Hello guys, this is Cody. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to import shortcuts from files. So I have used uh, some shortcut, uh, backup shortcuts to backup my shortcuts to the files app. So I'm gonna import them. So open the files app. So for example, this shortcut, this simple shortcut, when I, uh, in iOS 12, I can just uh, tap on this shortcut and import the shortcut as you get this. In iOS uh, 13, you get this message. Shortcuts cannot be opened. Importing shortcuts as files is not currently supported. So how do we get to do that? Well, you get this shortcut in iOS 13, import shortcuts from files. I'll share the link in the description. So then I'm going to open the files app. For example, this shortcut, tap, tap on share. and find the iOS 13 import shortcuts find this shortcut couldn't be found because I don't know how I get this error I haven't figured it out I don't know why I'd get this error. Uh, access token has expired. I'm gonna sort it out next time. So I'm, I'm gonna just uh, run this shortcut directly from. So I can op open the files app. I can choose the shortcut. So this is my backup. So I'm gonna. And a random one, just uh, this one. Of course. Okay, you see? This stack move shortcut and add untrusted shortcut, of course. Then I just uh, imported one shortcut. Well, you may also you use this online shortcut editor. So you can upload your shortcut file and then you edit it on your Mac or PC. And then you're gonna Then you can import to your shortcuts app, of course. So I'm gonna import this shortcut. So export this shortcut and tap down. So I cannot e export it from, from my iPad. So this works well on the PC or Mac. So then you're gonna just run this shortcut to import the, any shortcut. So 
that's pretty much it for this video hope you find this helpful i'll see you in the next one